Welcome to our Kotlin Coding Corner. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with nullable types. Our viewer is curious about how to declare a K-class for nullable values in Kotlin. Specifically, they want to know if there's a syntax to represent a nullable string, like string, when using Kotlin Poet to generate classes. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. In Kotlin, when you wanna declare a K-class for a nullable type, you can use the question mark syntax. For example, to represent a nullable string, you would use string class. When using Kotlin Poet to generate classes, you can specify nullable properties by appending a question mark to the type. This indicates that the property can hold a null value. To create a nullable property in Kotlin Poet, you can use the nullable method in the property spec builder. This will ensure that the generated property is of type string In summary, to declare a nullable K-class in Kotlin, use the question mark syntax. And when generating properties with Kotlin Poet, remember to call the nullable method. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Kotlin Poet version 2.0 has been released, introducing support for nullable types with the as nullable function. For instance, you can create a nullable property like this, property spec.builder with as nullable. This will generate a property of type string indicating it's nullable. Also, be aware that some function signatures have changed from type name to name type, which may affect your existing code. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To create a K-class reference for nullable values in Kotlin Poet 1.10, you can use a simple code snippet. Just copy the type name and set nullable to true. For more details, you can check the official Kotlin Poet documentation on nullable types. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped you find that solution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers. Thank <laughs> you.